The Aditya Birla Midcap Fund was incepted in 2002 and has remained a true to label midcap strategy. The manager applies a buy and hold approach that's diversified across stocks and sectors, thereby reducing stock specific risk. The aim is to invest in companies with product lines that could potentially turn them into multi baggers. The fund has witnessed a few manager changes. Despite this, the core philosophy of the fund has remained intact and the mandate has been followed consistently. Anil Shah has been managing this fund since May 2020. We have a positive view on Shah and we think that, that, that his investment style is extremely well thought out. He has been associated with the AMC for over 10 years and also manages their FlexiCap strategy. The manager tries to diversify the portfolio across 50 to 70 stocks. Weights are typically capped at 3%, despite the mandate allowing the manager a leeway of plus or minus 3% versus the benchmark on individual stock positions and plus or minus 4% at a sector level. The fund's profile changed slightly under Shah's leadership, with the fund carrying a slightly higher large cap exposure as compared to peers. Shah's portfolio also carries a longer tail, with around 30 stocks carrying weights lower than 1%. Shah looks at investing in themes and expects these themes to play out over a three to five year horizon. He typically remains invested in sectors or stocks until his investment thesis plays out. The fund is currently overweight sectors like basic materials and technology. Underweight sectors include consumer defensives, communication services and financials. Having said that, financials, materials and cyclical sectors remain the largest weights on the portfolio on an absolute basis and constitute about 45% of the portfolio. The manager can tend to hold slightly higher levels of cash based on market movements. Multiple manager changes have dented the fund's long-term performance, given that individual managers have plied their distinctive styles by managing this fund. The fund has also witnessed a significant underperformance during the period between 2018 and 2020, before posting a second quartile performance in 2021. While a higher allocation to cash likely impacted performance in 2018, the increased valuations and volatility impacted the fund's performance across these years. We think that Shah is a very capable manager and has the wherewithal to manage the fund in an efficient manner. However, investors should be aware of the relatively higher levels of large caps on the fund.